Hello, I'm Pierre Machetou, an Adventist teaching at Paris 7 University. I also serve as a visiting professor at Geneva University. I have been on the development team for the ProTaper instrument since the beginning. Along with my colleagues John West and Cliff Ruddell, we work on those initial designs with the idea that we would transfer the concept of the renowned Dr. Herb Schilder to rotary file design. Those ideas included early coronal enlargement, which was in fact the first description of what we know now as a crown down technique. Dr. Schilder also advocated passive apical instrumentation, meaning that the file should never be forced to progress apically. This led us to develop an instrument that would work on the outstroke as opposed to being required to do its work by pressing it and often forcing it into the canal space. These ideas culminated in an unique multiple taper design that combined several instruments into one. We also wanted sharp cutting edges for efficiency, but we did not want to sacrifice safety. Once the engineers were able to work through the difficult task associated with the manufacturing process, we were able to introduce the initial ProTaper. It was a revolutionary product and quickly became the most popular file in the world. But as we and clinicians around the world use a file, we continue to collect ideas and that would improve the file. ProTaper Universal was the result. In 2005, we introduced the updated version to have a more complete line of files. We were able to expand the available size with the F4 and F5 and improve the flexibility at the same time. But the improvements were not done. Clinicians were tackling ever more difficult cases and needed even more flexibility, especially in the finishers, which were designed to work primarily in the apical zones. Advancements in metallurgy allow us to test the ProTaper universal design with several different alloys. The best turned out to be the gold wire. This unique treatment gave us extraordinary strength, flexibility and safety. It has become a much more forgiving file in my mind. More flexibility allows us the ability to refine the mode of use. It's very easy to understand. Brush and follow for shapers. Follow and brush and paint for finishers. With the first file, we use a strong outstroke motion away from the furcation in order to create more space. This allows the file to move passively deeper without any pecking action. With finishers, the motion is reversed. The file should follow the path of the canal and then a soft painting action is made to help the file safely advance. With the ProTaper Gold instrument, we are able to address all kinds of clinical situations and get predictable and reproducible shapes. As we all know, these are key factors for successful endodontic procedures. I believe that you will enjoy and even have fun playing the game of root canal shaping thanks to the advancement in technologies that we have incorporated into ProTaper Gold. Mm -hmm.